Hello and welcome to my channel. This is Angela with Angela's Crafty Space. Today I have a Tuesday morning haul and it is my final Tuesday morning haul. My store has closed permanently near my job so I will not be able to go to Tuesday morning anymore. Unless I travel like, I don't know, probably 50 miles or something like that. I think it's the nearest store now. And I think it's closing also, so I'm not even going to bother. But um, I did get some good stuff. So I got these sea beads in every color imaginable, as you can see. And it didn't even have a quantity. All it had was like a weight. And what's really cool is this case opens up and then each individual color is in its own like little tic-tac container if I can get it out here isn't that cool and then it opens like that and then you pour it out like so isn't that cool I never had anything like this to hold my seed beads in so I'm really excited about this this was $10.99 so I got it for like four bucks which is a great deal then I got these stamps these are hip stamp hooray and it's called wreath clear stamp set and it's it's floral basically this heart stencil that's metal can't wait to use this on my jelly plate this sticker book by Jen Hatfield and it is got some really cute stickers in it some of them are like planner stickers but not all of them like there's some washi tape kind there's some gold ones there's some more washi tape kind some more florals yeah so quite a bit so that I have a big bag, you guys, so it's going to take a while to go through it. We got some Sizzix glitter and some tulip glitter. I grabbed all the glitter I could find. I don't have very much of it. I can't say that any longer. I think that's all the glitter. So we got this, which was $10.99, so I got it for $4.00. And this glitter is by Sizzix. And each color has its own little container that says Sizzix on it. So we got this one with like the reds and the gold. And then I got this one. This one also has a white. So I have two whites. And then this one had the silver and a blue gray like a turquoise and like a purplish blue I guess it's kind of hard to see but yeah so I got all those glitters love the packaging because it will keep everything nice and tidy and then I got these tulip ones. Not sure how this packaging works. Let's open up one and see. So each of these were $3.29. So I got them for like a dollar and change. So that's not bad. The Sizzix ones were quite expensive. They were like $3 and change, I think. No, so they, it was $10.99. So let's just say $10. There's five of them in there. So that'd be like two and some change for each one at regular price. So yeah, these were probably about a dollar a piece as well. So then this twists off and then you open it up. So it's not it's not very secure, except that does turn. So so yeah, so that's how that opens. So I got a bunch of glitter for like a dollar and change each. So that's nice. That'll be fun to, to incorporate into my project. Then I got some fall stuff. And some, I'm just going to grab out here. 
here's some stencils here. These are by Journal Studio American Crafts, $3.29, so I got them for a dollar and change. There's this rose wood, this spot wood, this one, and lines. This is the one that sold me right here for journal cards and things, the back of them. Tags, whatever. So I got this set of tags. This is eight tags. And they're all different. So I just thought these were cool. So I just wanted to get another pack. Because I did do a, a pack already like this. I covered the fronts. So this one says beautiful. And then there's a couple plain ones. Like four plain ones and four regular, four decorated ones. And those are by Heidi Slot. I'm just gonna put these back in here real quick. Okay, and then we got, I got some more of this Flora frames and tags. So this is what you get in there. So yeah, so that's fun. And then I got this one by Simple Stories. It's Simple Vintage something. Garden, Weathered Garden. Simple Vintage Weathered Garden. So I thought this was cool. I like the noted with the circle and the sweet with the oval. Yeah, th that caught my eye. And then this one was $16.99. So I got it for seven and change. <clears throat> and it's these stamps that are like fall type. And then it has the die cuts with it. So you get the stamps with the die cuts. And that's my photo play. Spellbinders. This was ten ninety nine, so I got it for four dollars and change. And it's this, uh, this kind of die. Then I got some more of this "God Bless America" ephemera, because I plan on doing a big send out for Fourth of July. Here's another one of those floras. So I just showed you that. It's the same one. Then this one I got, uh, Journal Bits by Simple Stories, Hearth and Home. So this one's got these kind of bits in it, because it's journal bits. So it's stuff to put in, like, a journal. Decorative things. And so on. Okay. Here's another one of those God Bless America ones. Okay, and then I got this one from Spellbinders. So it's similar to the other one, but the other one is bigger. And it's more square. See the difference? This one's more oval. Oh, I did get two of that, though. Okay, so I do have two of this one. No big deal. I can do a giveaway or something. I don't know. We'll see. Then I got this Howdy. Bits and pieces, super cute. It's like Old West style, so that'll be fun. Then I got this one by Pink Paisley, Paige Evans, ephemera, 40 pieces, so it comes with all this. Very cool. And then Day in the Life, frames and tags, so it comes with all this. Got another one of this stamp set for a dollar. You can't beat it. So I will, sorry about that. I will uh, be giving this away as well. So I might do a giveaway here on my channel real soon with some of these extras. So this is a dupe. So I already have this one as well, but I loved it. So I wanted to get another one. And then we got this chipboard frame pieces by, it's called Farmhouse Summer. And it's made in America. I'm trying to see who it's by. I think it's by Pre. No, not Prima. Carth Bell. Huh. 
Huh, it doesn't say who it's by. I wonder if it's under the sticker. Cardabella, yeah. It's Cardabella, guys. <laughs> All right, then we got this Graphic 45 one. Now, the pieces are in here. They just came out of their spot, so. There we go. Yeah, that'll be super fun to play with. Then we got this stamp and die set. It has a typewriter. And then it comes with the die for it. And hello, friend. That's what it looks like when you make it. We got this die set here, and then it comes with some flowers as well. The flowers are probably down there. Here's another one of that stamp set, so I have two of those. Here's some Old West stickers to go with the uh, Howdy Doody. This is $14.99, so I got it for seven and change. It's some snowflake dies. I thought they were real pretty for winter. My son was in the Navy, so I picked up some Navy stickers for a project. Our wedding day, but I just thought that the sentiments were awesome, so I got it. Here's another pack of those tags. Another pack of flora. So it looks like I have enough to do two giveaway packages. This one is called Scenic Root. Oh, I didn't show you that one yet. That one has this kind of pieces in it. Then this was interesting. It's a rub-on foil kit. I hope there's directions in here because I have no idea. I might have to look it up. But it's by Heidi Swap. And it just says rub-on foil kit. That's what you come with. That's what it comes with. So we'll have to see about that. And then I got this Sizzix die. Thought that was cute. Uh, Journal Bits Into the Wild by Simple Stories. Thought those were adorable. Farmer's Market by Eco Park. So it comes with these kinds of pieces. Here's another one of those stamp sets. So I grabbed three of those stamp sets. So I have three of those, okay? So that, I could do three um, giveaways. Then I got this stamp, this die, and it's big. So I opened it up to see how big it was, and it's big. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna use it for, but I thought this design was cool for like a journal card or something, so we'll see. We'll use it for something, I'm sure. For four bucks, you can't beat it. And then we have this pink paisley set. It is called Sweet Freedom. Again, for my 4th of July project that I plan on doing. And we're almost to the end. Wow. That didn't take as long as I thought. So I got this cute little embossing folder. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, it's very pretty. Here's another one of the day of the life. So I have two of those. Uh, Farmer's Market. I saw that one already. This one is Simple Pages by Simple Stories. Page Pieces. And it's 11 card stock die cut ephemera page pieces. And this is what they say. Bloom and Grow roses you know my my mo here's another one of those rub on kits i got two of those and here's another day in the life so I have three of those and then this fiddlet die set with this pretty flower it's a washi tape and that is it for my final tuesday morning haul you guys i'm so sad all right thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time with another haul. Bye-bye.